before attending First Presbyterian Church, um, my relationship with God was pretty inactive. Um, my mom was raised Catholic um, and my dad Lutheran. And so my brother and I were baptized Lutheran, but we only went to church um, on major holidays. Um, a few times throughout my adult life, um, I attended a few other Lutheran churches, but it just, nothing felt right. Um, nothing captured my attention. Um, I was eager to learn more about God, um, about Jesus and his journey to save us from sin. I knew I was full of sin. I mean, who isn't? Um, in 2013, I was invited to attend this church with our neighbors, and I immediately felt welcome. I was greeted right away, shook hands with many of the attendees, and was even invited for fellowship after the service. And this was a complete 180 from what I was used to. Um, Finally, I found a place where I fit in. And since my first visit with First Presbyterian Church, um, my faith has grown immensely. I kind of see my faith as like a little seed um, that was planted when I was young but never watered. Um, finally, First Presbyterian Church turned on the sprinklers and I was called to join this church. Over the years, I've become involved with different ministries around the church, anywhere from Kingdom Kids to St. Jude Walks, serving as a deacon, attending Belize mission trips, um, and teaching vocation Bible school. And I have a bit of a confession to make. Um, when Pastor James asked me a few years ago to be a deacon, <clears throat> I asked myself, how desperate are these people if they were asking me, Katie, how to be a deacon? <laughs> I still laugh when I think about it. Um, I had no clue um, about anything in this church, let alone how to serve. But man, was I wrong. Uh, Pastor James was right. Being a deacon is a calling. Um, it's a calling to help serve the Lord um, and to meet the needs of the congregation. And helping others in need is one of my strongest values. Um, it may sound silly, but being a deacon saved me in a way. Um, it pushed me out of my comfort zone to meet people very quickly, um, to get involved in church activities and uh, develop connections with people that now I consider family. Um, a few years ago, um, I came to a very difficult point in my life where I needed to choose between family and my career. Um, after a lot of prayer, a lot of conversation with family and friends, um, I knew but the Holy Spirit was leading me um, down the path that would bring me closer to God. I was in a bad place mentally, emotionally, spiritually, um, and physically. Um, with the help um, of prayer and FPC, I chose family, uh, not career, and I am so thankful that I did. Um, since then, I've been able to focus on my well-being um, and improve my mind, body, spirit. The Holy Spirit empowered me to make these changes, um, and it truly, truly saved me. I would never have gotten through this difficult time in my life without this church, the people in it, and the experiences that I've encountered while here. Um, it's truly an honor to be a member of First Presbyterian Church. Um, I now know what it means to be a sinner called by God, um, redeemed by Jesus Christ, and empowered by the Holy Spirit.